It's a creation that happened from um, being a performer for many years, being in bands for many years, and um, then uh, I kind of got involved in the burlesque scene here in the performance art scene and um, in Sydney, and I kind of fell in love with it. And then I met this other amazing artist named Willem van Eckert with me, and so we formed a band out of uh, people that we've just become friends with through having coffee, and uh, we started jamming, and, and um, I've been, I'd been doing several shows in warehouses for about a year at that point, and uh, just like underground, kind of really chaotic, dirty, anything goes kind of variety shows, um, which I think is the essence of what like a, a real, the original kind of cabaret experience was, was you go there to see something that's going to shock you. And um, I think people then might have been more easily shocked back in the day when that stuff started, but um, I think things have been kind of tamed down. You know, you'll see something like Sideshow, where you know, I'll be hammering a nail into my face or eating fire, um, swallowing a balloon, and or um, Sky Gelman balancing on five cylinders all going in different directions, and it makes your heart skip a beat because you're just kind of terrified. And so then again, engaging your body in another level with the music also moving through your body. So that's what I'm doing with um, The Cube, is uh, I had a really wonderful time performing there myself. And, um, but the thing about it is that in some ways you can, you can feel really separated when you're in a cube, and you can, and that can be a very powerful thing, is to be separated and isolated. But um, I feel like because it is glass, you can see through it, and it's in a music venue, and it's in a bar, that Cabaret Sasquatch would really go well with that because it brings the art with the music and the performance and the socializing. Starting on the 15th of May, uh, Cabaret Sasquatch and me, Marlena Dali Rosenthal, will be taking over Oxford Art Factory, starting with The Cube for, uh, from the 15th of May, from every weekend, until then on um, the Thursday, the 2nd of July, when not only will there be artists in The Cube, but then the band will be on the main stage and the artists will filter out onto the stage and work with the band and perform with the band. And so it'll be a whole takeover of Cabaret Sasquatch and all, as well as a kind of collaboration with the use of the space um, at Oxford Art Factory. So let's see, we have, um, so every single artist that is involved uh, with who I'm putting into the cube ha has worked with Cabaret Sasquatch. They're all performers that um, I see as being really strong independent artists outside of working with the band. Even though they're all very different artists uh, with very different skills, as like uh, Georges Lafine is a ballerina trained uh, contemporary dance artist, and uh, Sky Gelman is a circus artist, um, and we have um, Gemma Lark, who does sideshow and puppeteering, and she went to NIDA. And um, we have uh, Gareth Hart coming up from Melbourne, who is a uh, contemporary dance artist and performance artist. Um, and then we have uh, Natalie Pixie Renwick, who uh, mostly does, she does performance, but she also is a painter and an installation artist. And they're all also very connected with music. And that is a very important part of why I've chosen them. Uh, their relationship with movement and music works very well with everything Cabaret Sasquatch.